confidence and the resiliency of this football team. Well, coach, under Coach Johnson, dude conditioning a lot. I mean, that's what it come down to. What was the message to you guys at halftime? I mean, you're down 15-3 at halftime. You outscore them 29 to like, you know, almost a 10, I think, or something like that. Well, come back, run the ball down the throats like, like we can do. I mean, it obviously worked. Conditioning can also another part. To be 2-0 and on the season, too, that's huge to get a victory. Oh, it feels great. I love it. This team was able to accomplish now 15-3 at halftime. You outscore them 29-7 to the rest of the way. Yeah, you know, I'm real proud of the character of the team. You know, we, we, we preach and practice every day. We're never going to give up. We work hard. Everything that we do has a drill where we finish, and we know we're going to play 48 minutes when we come out. Uh, my hats goes off to Hickory Ridge, Coach Paxson. They did a great job. I mean, they're one of the better teams in the area. I mean, coming off a season they had last year, um, they run a great scheme. Uh, we just were fortunate enough to make some stops late and get some momentum, and it kind of turned into some big points in the second half. And to start the season 2-0, and I mean, that's huge for this team, considering you guys really have yet to have that true home game. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, Road Warriors, Road Warriors. Uh, yeah, you know, I think it really, it's good for the school community. It's good for the football program. Um, you know, first time they're ever 2-0. and I'm really happy for the boys back here. You know, they work hard. They put the hours in. And for them to come out and execute and, and really win, you know, it was, it was a good sign. We think the chances are that maybe you guys finally get a home game here next week. Any, any chance on that? Or? Yeah, it looks good. It looks good for next week. But, boy, Monroe. We got a juggernaut coming in, so you know we got it. We got to rest up. And we got to get ready to go because they're they're one of the best teams. I played them when I was at Barry Academy, and and I'm going to play them now again. And they are fast and big, and, and we got to get really get to work and get ready for them next week. But it looks like it will be at home. Thank God. <laughs> you mentioned the murderer's row of schedules too. To be a great team, that's what you've got to do. You got to go out and beat these great teams. You've done that. Not that this team has gotten to where it needs to be yet, but you got to be happy with the progress. Right, it's, it's, it's a process for us. This was mission number two. Now we're on to mission number three. We don't look ahead. We control what we can control, which right now we'll be having a great week of practice and getting ready for Monroe, and we'll deal with that, and whatever comes later down the road, we'll get there when we get there.